Hey, hey, bubble on deck. I'm on holiday out. <sighs> okay, so <laughs> can we talk about these these holidays? I'm so sick of it. Like, ugh. if you really look at it, businesses, commercialism have come up with a way to, to get all your money. Every paycheck that you make, they want your money. Okay, is that is that money over there? Oh, did you get a bonus? Oh, you got a raise? Let me have that. Is that extra money? Go ahead and bring that over here. <laughs> yeah. No, you can't afford it. No, you don't need that. Is that extra money? Go ahead and get it anyway. It's on sale. Is that extra money? They put everything on sale. They put sales on sales. Have you ever heard of a pre-sale? That means a sale before the sale. Let me tell you what that means. Give me all your money. You work for me. You go get your check and you bring it to me. Okay, I got some place for you to spend it. And let me tell you something. I'm sick of the holidays because it is November 1st. Today is the 1st of November. Today, the first of the month. Halloween just got done. I just got my candy on sale. Like, I don't celebrate Halloween, but what I do do, I celebrate chocolate, okay? And chocolate was on sale because of Halloween. So therefore, I got my candy, okay? Don't come to my door for trick or treat. Like what you won't do is knock on my door and get candy. No, that's my candy. Okay, go next door. Go to her, get her candy. Okay, she got that for you, okay? Just so you know, be very clear. You go over there. She's next door with the, her lights on. Okay, don't come by here, okay? But um, we all just went broke for Halloween. Like, just whether you bought candy, whether you bought costumes, whatever you were into and whatever you did. Because I saw your little costumes on the internet. Y'all was looking like somebody, everybody out here in these streets. Okay, y'all did a good job. But let me tell you what you didn't do. What you didn't do is count up how much all of that makeup and hair and wigs and things and stuff cost just for you to take a photo and put it on Instagram. I hope you did more than just put your photo on Instagram and now you sitting here broke on the first of the month. Okay, because let me tell you why. I got a message in my email today about, let me tell you what the message said. It's November 1st. We're not even done with Halloween. I still got a Halloween freestyle video up on my channel. It got about two views, okay? So go watch the video because it still got like two views. What had happened was I put it up too late. And I just did it last spare of the moment. That's how I that's how I roll. But what happened was Halloween is one day long, but it was a weekend. You know I was Halloween this year? Because that was more money for you to spend. You probably went and bought two or three outfits. You had a party on Saturday, you had a party on Sunday, and then Halloween came on Monday and you bought some candy for them kids that was gonna come to your door, or you you took your kids to people's door and get some candy. I know you did. I know I know you spent your money. You broke, ain't you? You broke, ain't you? Ain't you broke? You broke like me, ain't you? We broke, ain't you? I'm gonna say we broke, cause we in this together. You and me and all of the strugglers, okay? We broke, ain't you? I'm gonna just say you though. I don't know you like that yet, but just say, ain't we. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be all right, I think. But you broke, ain't you? You you broke, ain't you? Is you broke? Let me know if you broke. It's the first of the month. It's November's of the first, okay? <laughs> And already, there's no time of the year where it's not a holiday. There's no time of the year where it's not something to buy. There's no time of the year where it's not a sale that they're giving so that you can give them some of your money. They just don't know when to stop. They don't, okay? You broke, ain't you? Make a broke face. You broke, ain't you? And sitting in my inbox is... Countdown to Black Friday deals week? Nigga, it's November 1st. We, they ain't even finna saying Happy Halloween. There was still candy at, at work today. People still had candy that was giving out and stuff. Like people were still talking about their costumes and stuff. And you already count down to Black Friday? How you? So you, you ain't even get to the like you just gonna you just gonna act like Thanksgiving don't even exist, right? Is that because you don't sell food? And that's another thing about you, um, commercial you businesses. You people always trying to take people money. You people always trying to make money and trying to take our money. When it's not even something that they sell, they still get involved. It's like yeah, I know Thanksgiving is for the grocery stores. You know people gonna go get some food and finally cook for the one day in the year that they gonna cook and you trying to be a part of that like you just can't even let thanksgiving live can you you want to count down to black friday and it's november 1st is that how we doing like people didn't even take down their halloween decorations yet is you crazy and you talking about black friday is you crazy so like <laughs> i didn't even read the, the email we are counting down the black friday deals week and they are great deals every day the email said 
Any day you got money, go ahead and spend it. That's what the email said. Is you classy? But what they wrote was, we are counting down Black Friday deals week. And there are sales every day. That's what the email said. Is you classy? Just like, spend that money. If you prime, you're going to get your shipping. You got to you gotta make your prime membership worth it, right? Nigga, it's November 1st. Spend that money. Go ahead and go broke. You know what I'm saying? Because this this is the time that you go broke. And it's okay if you go broke. You know why? Because there's a payday loan company out there. There's somebody out there with predatory lending willing to give you more money that you ain't got. Yeah, so your Christmas and your Thanksgiving is lit. So your turkey got the stuff in. Like, don't, don't have no turkey and can't put the stuffing in it. So you're going to need to take that payday loan to pay for them onions you bought. We're going to give you 300% rates for them onions. That's what needs to happen. But just go ahead and put them chips on the credit card. You know what I'm saying? Just slide it on the credit card. You pay for that interest later. Like, it's cool. It's cool. Like, that's what y'all telling us. Because you just going to not, you just going to jump out of, we just finished spending for Halloween. And now you talking about Thanksgiving. You talking about Black Friday. No, you ain't even talking about Thanksgiving. You talking about Black Friday. Like, we don't got to pay for Thanksgiving. Like, turkeys are free. Really? Really? Like, pies are free. Like, that's what you're doing. And you're thinking we don't know. And then, let's not even go there. Because right after we finish with the Black Friday deals, like, right after you go for broke, okay? Right after you take that loan, you know, you couldn't afford here come Christmas. Like after you go buy that that new TV, that 37 TV that you got a deal for, that that 16th washing machine that you got in a fight for. Like right after that is Christmas. So now you really gonna have to fight. <laughs> we talking all the struggles. This is struggle season. And it's cold outside so people don't care about people. Like people gonna be stepping over the homeless people this season. Like nah homie, I'm with you. I just got a crib, but we, we, we one in the same. You know what I'm saying? We one in the same. I just want you to be aware the tricks are still happening. I mean, President's Day, it don't matter. I'm going to definitely be single for Valentine's Day because, like, I can't afford no gifts. You know what I'm saying? Like, I can't even afford, like, even if he was going to take me out, I can't I can't afford to get dressed to get ready. You know what I'm saying? Like, I can't afford the hair. You know what I'm saying? I just, I can't put it all in my budget right now. I'm trying to invest in my music career. You know what I'm saying? I got, I got my budget on hold. So, later for all that dating and stuff, like, later for all that gift giving, can we just be a family for love? <laughs> like, I don't even need no gifts this year. Could we save our money this year? Like, talk to your family. See if maybe, um, like, I, I know it's only November, guys, but I, I was thinking about it. Like, maybe we don't buy each other no gifts this year. Like, we only making the stores richer. Could we go on that struggle budget this year? I promise you, your Christmas will still be merry. <laughs> I promise. I'm, I don't know. I'm, I'm just trying to come up with a solution. I don't know. I really don't know. But I just want you to be aware that it's November 1st and they doing a countdown already to Black Friday. They playing them games. Don't be out here getting God. Just could you do that for me? All right. Because they, they tripping. After Black Friday going to be Cyber Monday. Like every they just creating. They're creating holidays for you to go broke. Like they trying to keep you broke. Like they just want you to buy. They just want you to buy. Like is that extra money? Tax return is a holiday. Tax return is a holiday. You do know that everybody gets involved with your tax return check. You know that everybody puts everything on sale from about mid-January to mid-April. That's for the refund people. The people that pay taxes, they ain't thinking about you. But everything is, you got your tax refund, we got a deal for you. We got your this refund, we got a sale for you. Like, it's just President's Day. It's just random stuff. Like, they just be closing banks down and closing things down and letting you be off work. Happy Martin Luther King. Go spend that money. Like, I'm just trying to understand it. Like, you let me off work so that I could go broke so that I would have to go back to work and do overtime? I just want to understand what's happening with my finances. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to understand my budget because I don't need all this time off work. I need overtime, actually. Um, I'm going to just sit at home when I get off because I can't afford all these sales. When there's a sale, though, if you didn't buy anything, you got 100% off. Just Remember that. If you don't buy anything, you're getting 100% off. All these sales, you're still spending, boo. You're spending. And I don't know if, I don't know. You broke, ain't you? You broke, ain't you? You broke, ain't you? That's, I don't know. Broke don't mean poor. I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. All right. But we're on deck. Don't forget to subscribe. Yo, <laughs> you know what it is? Hey, bubble on deck, bubble on deck. I'm the type of lady.